a shocking sight. What looked like someone hanging from a noose dangling over I-15. 911 was flooded with calls from drivers who thought this was real. Because when I looked at it, I couldn't believe it. I'm like, what and who would put that up there? The owners of this billboard, Lamar Advertising, immediately took down the high-flying prank, calling it vandalism. A similar billboard was reported at Highland and Desert Inn. Same hanging mannequin, different message. It makes you think. I mean, you don't have to think too hard. You can think, you know what it implies if you just just look at it and see what the sign says. You know what it implies, and it could be worse next time. Clear Channel Outdoor confirmed to us one of its billboards near Highway 95 in Sahara was also vandalized, but the sign company was able to take it down early. Some spectators are calling this a political statement, others a stunt. I don't know. I, uh, I hope they find out who it is, you know, and I'm sure I'm sure they will, and uh, it's going to be a publicity thing. These signs are private property, so whoever did this could be facing charges of vandalism and trespassing. A risky way to send a message, but it's been heard far and wide. Michaela Zern, Channel 13, Action News.